I'm Matt Watson with Access VR. Uh, just kind of tell us, uh, tell you a little bit about what we are doing. Uh, our big thing is making virtual reality accessible to as many people as possible. And how do we do that? Well, a lot of what we found is 360 video is one of the great, easiest ways to start implementing virtual reality training. We find that majority of our customer base is already doing live training, simulation training, and what happens is historically we lose everything that we've gained there. Meaning they go through this high fidelity simulation, might take some photographs, maybe we do some after action evaluations, but as far as the simulation itself, it's lost. So our goal is utilizing 360, placing a camera in that experience, collecting that video, and then turning that video into lessons. That allows the end user, the trainers, the educators, to now become content creators. We don't necessarily see that virtual reality is something that the layperson has had easy access to. We're trying to change that. That's what Access VR is about, is making virtual reality training accessible to everyone, utilizing their own content. You can see from the screens here above me, an example of how we would kind of develop a training. What we would have is an educator record an experience and then place that experience inside of the platform. When it's inside of the platform, it gives the educator the opportunity to add layers over top of the experience. Those layers are then the interactive capabilities of the program, meaning adding quizzes, blocks of text, even two-dimensional videos of, let's say, an educator specifically addressing a certain point in the training. All of that is a subscription-based service. We find that our price point is very user-friendly because our goal is just that, to get as many users on the platform and make it accessible to everyone. So what we've got here is an individual going through a finished lesson. Once the lesson's published and available, the students can get in the headset. This is a three-dof experience, so they're in a fixed point. We find it's a lot safer for the students because you could get multiple people in different experiences at the same time. What you see on the screen, this was actually an active shooter exercise that we had captured at one of the local high schools. Once again, that would have been historical information lost once the exercise was over. Now it's collected and turned into consumable lessons. This platform is also consumable on things like desktop computers, such as what we have here, as well as other smart devices, including iPads, because it is not just Android, but also Apple compatible. Uh, we also find that sometimes our users create content that they would like to share and actually help them generate revenue. We have a marketplace aspect as well. So our subscribers could create a great lesson, a great training program, and make it consumable by others and receive a portion of those profits. So the dashboard is our starting point in the platform. This is where the user gets started. A lot of what we do is simple drag and drop. You are building out asset library. Your asset library is 360 video content, 360 images, and letterbox or traditional theater-based 2D video. All of those we can utilize to build and create lessons from.